The whole thing around hair loss is dihydrotestosterone binding to the hair follicles and choking them out. This is what we want to stop. DHT in a whole is really not that useful of a androgen and could be taken out. Now, finasteride and dutasteride, they block the enzyme 5-alpha reductase to stop the conversion from testosterone to dihydrotestosterone. You lower the total serum concentration of dihydrotestosterone in your body, your hair starts growing back rapidly. Problem is 5-alpha alpha reductase isn't just used to convert testosterone to dihydrotestosterone. You're blocking all of that. And you're overall, you're lowering the genetic expression of 5-alpha reductase throughout your body. Now, dutasteride blocks one and two and is overall the best way to keep your hair pretty much your entire life by you're sacrificing all the other conversions by blocking the expression of 5-alpha reductase. Over time, you're going to notice neurosteroids, GABA, allopregnanolone levels dip.